How government can cope the illicit drug issue in Nigeria? The government can't do so much by force. The only thing they can do is go to get them arrested. There are policies, there are you know structures that can that the government can bring to bear in Nigeria to really arrest those that are trafficking it those that are selling it and those that are using it if government can actually put a measure to it i believe that will go a long way because most of the youth out there uh, hard drug has turned them to something else from underage to middle age of boys of this generation, they have gone far in hard drugs. Punish them in the way that maybe when they even come out from there, they will not even be able to go into it again. Because this is beyond our control. Let it be clear that these are the rules in place. Let, let it be pronounced. Let there be awareness. I can't tell the government what to do because they know what to do actually. The government can do something about that by inspecting those companies uh, and those people that sells them. Basically, the government has a lot to do by educating the people, creating like online groups where people can meet, tell their stories, how they got into it. A lot of people are into it and they want to go out of it, but they don't know how. Though it's the work of the government to make a to take a decision concerning that, you know, we look at the streets today, uh, we have lots of uh, mental derailed men. The consequences for those that actually are caught in the act, let it be known that this is what happens to such people and it will be a warning, to be a deterrent, all right, to others using it. Some time ago I went to a supermarket to buy provisions. And uh, one of the Milo cartons, so I was expecting Milo to be inside the carton. But by the time I opened it, it was this hard drugs, codeine or whatever they call it, that filled the carton. And I went to the man who sells them. I said, you're supposed to be selling provisions, like uh, tea and all that. How come you have drugs in, in, your, in your business? And you know, he was just pleading. And I told him to do away with that because I'm going to report him. And uh, my son, I, I discovered he didn't, you know, take to that instructions and I have to report him. And thank God for the people, the policemen from Eriaev who came and evaded him and he was arrested. And I think that stopped.